So today I actually wanted to do a video on my influences on YouTube. I have a bunch that I actually like to watch and enjoy watching. But there's a select few that I always check up on. Because they post great information. And a lot of do-it-yourself stuff. So the first one obviously is going to be one of my favorites. Which would be DIY Sportsman. If you guys haven't heard of him, check him out. Definitely one of the best on YouTube as far as hunting related goes. Does everything from reviews to his own personal hunts, Colorado elk hunts, things he packs, even do-it-yourself climbing sticks. Pretty cool. Now, another one I like also would be G2 Outdoors. Definitely another good one. A lot of information on saddle hunting, which I think that's something I'm going to actually try out this year. Lots of cool and Definitely get some nice bucks also. It's another one you should check out. Another one I like will be Leatherwood Outdoors. I don't know if you guys know that one. I believe he's out of Pennsylvania. Yeah, Pennsylvania. Definitely a very knowledgeable guy. It's another one you guys should check out. You can't, you can't leave out the best one, though. The Hunt and Beast, Dan Infault. If you guys ain't members of the website, definitely join. I learned a lot of information from him. Definitely when it comes to public land, one of the best hunters around, if not the best. Another good one, I believe his name is Adam, I want to say. Adam and Zach. Um, they're pretty good. They hunt public also. Very knowledgeable. Midwest Whitetails, do a lot of public and private, um, but the ones I tend to stick to are the ones with Adam and Zach, definitely pretty good guys. Um, there's a few more out there that I like to watch, but them are mostly the ones I definitely pay the most attention to. Um, check them out, give them a like, subscribe if you like them, and definitely join the Hunting Beast website, it's a good website.